Hello, this is Julie. I watched Troy's video with interest today as he responded to questions about why some fonts don't work well in Cricut Design Space and it reminded me how we can use Make the Cut to fix some of the problems that he noted. In particular, he was using the KG Second Chances sketch font to demonstrate how some fonts are very, very complex and won't work very well in Cricut Design Space, but Make the Cut has a solution that I thought I would show you. I just wrote this text, drawing text with pens and accept and make the cut. So I have this text using the same font that he was using. Use a different text, but that's okay. And as he noted, if you go to click on this wrench icon at the bottom of the screen and make the cut and view path detail, you will see that this particular text, all, every a node shows up as green in this preview window and there are over 20,364 nodes in this particular selection. Design space will only handle three to five thousand nodes or the software may not work. So what to do about that? Because there, this is a hand-drawn text and it would be nice to be able to draw this with pens in the cutter, I don't want to give up on it. I would just like to get rid of some of those excess nodes so that I don't end up with all kinds of errors in design space. So here's what I do. First, I'm going to click on the Join icon at the bottom of the screen to join all of these pieces together as one piece and then I'm going to hold control shift and drag to make it copy because I'm going to I want to compare what I started with with what I ended up with after getting rid of a bunch of these nodes to get rid of the nodes all I'm going to do is reduce the size of the text I'm going to click on the wrench icon and click on Auto Simplify Path or simply use Control Shift Z. Now in this window you'll see that before I simplified I had 20,364 nodes and now I have only 3,014. Now 3,014 nodes will go into Cricut Design Space very readily. So I'm just going to resize this back again to where it was so that you can see that it looks the same as the original over here. But now I can use this text in Cricut Design Space. So I can select it, go to File, Export, Selection to SVG, and I'll just give the file a name, Drawing Text with Pens, and Save. Now I can go into Cricut Design Space, sign in, Now I can create new project, upload images, this is a vector upload, browse to my file that I just saved, drawing text with pens, open, save, click on it and bring it into my screen and you notice it came in. I didn't get any errors. Now I can click on Go. If I have my Explorer hooked up to it, I can go ahead and draw this. It takes about seven minutes to draw on my Explorer, 
but it works just fine. And you notice that I did not have any errors whatsoever. That's because it doesn't have more nodes than the software can handle. So this is one of those times where third-party software is extremely helpful. If you have a, a font that doesn't work too well, try it in third-party software, especially Make the Cut, where you can get rid of those excess nodes and bring it right into Cricut Design Space ready to cut or draw or whatever you would like to do with it. I hope that this will give you some additional options for cutting to your explore. Thanks for watching. Bye.